Hi guys, Wayne Marble here. Nothing too long and strenuous and stressful today. Gonna talk body angles. Now, this is purely for when you're throwing at different parts of the board. So double top, double three, double 16, double 18, or double four. A lot of people have been asking me about what to do with the, the body angle. Do you just lower the elbow or, or do you just lower the torso completely? Well, the first thing you have to do, no matter where you stand, keep the legs still. Don't have this going on. Don't, don't twist everything. So just focus on twisting the torso. The legs will go with it, but don't try to get too, too hippy so everything moves too much. So I would stand about here. If I want tops, that's me aiming for tops. If I want double three, so there's tops, there's double three. The torso and the elbow come down. If it was to be from tops to double three with just the elbow, I'd be standing nice and tall and then doing that. Well, now I've got a different sight than what I had for tops and it just looks like I'm gonna go low. And again, if I had my elbow there, going for double three, that is absolutely fine. But if I was to raise up to go for tops with just the elbow, Bear in mind, my, my torso has come lower because I'm doing it the right way. So my torso is slightly lower. If I don't, now I'm going for tops. Well, now I feel like I want to stand up. So you move both. You move both the torso and the elbow. So just to show you, this is tops. It's actually a double five. That's the tops and double three. See how the elbow is down and the torso, so that was tops, that's double through. That was on the wire, right. So you get my gist with that. It's, say tops, double through. You lower both, you do not do that or you do not do that. And with one side or the other, I'm gonna go for double six and double 11. This is double six, so I'm in exactly the same position, same footing, same everything. All I'm doing, I'm aiming for a 20 now, all I'm doing is just slightly moving the body, tilting the body out to the right, let the elbow follow it, and then bang. And then from double six to double 11, like I said, don't get too hippy. Don't make it feel like your legs are, are moving as well. So double six, double 11. Everything just kind of sways into place. Double 11. And back up to tops. I'm now standing that, standing that tiny bit more upright. I, I, I don't know measurements wise, but that's double 11, that's tops. And tops. And what you don't do, like I said, is say double 11, double top. Because your body is not in the same, or the best position to go for double top. Because there, it's my body angle is slightly angled over to the left. There is better. So just go over that once more. We go from double 16 to double 18. So always start off at the 20s for you. So there's my body angle for the 20s. Now 16s. Missed it. 16s. Got it. Now from 16s to double 18. See how the body just rises itself up. I've never missed double 18. Um, it rises up because it's a higher target. So you move the torso and the arm together. Otherwise you'll be moving one too much or the other will be in a poor position to then go for a higher target. So I hope that helps. 
keep the legs still, just a slight move of the torso and a slight move of the elbow and you're good to go. Thank you.